Latest on Invest 92L, which has a high chance of development in the Atlantic in the next few days. It's currently located near 28 North, 86.8 West, and we're giving a 30 mile an hour winds, a pressure of 1010 millibars at 10 a.m. Eastern Time this July 10th. The CDPS scale is projecting a potential landfall on Marsh Island, Louisiana. That could change, by the way, on July 14th. Stage 3, if that does occur on the CDPS, the main threat is from rainfall. Um, the system itself will probably get to mid-range tropical storm status, but some models are saying hurricane, and that cannot be ruled out at this time. So there is its current position right now in relation to the map there, uh, just south of the Florida Panhandle region. It's 162 miles from Panama City, 168 from Destin, 171 from Pensacola, 209 from Biloxi, Mississippi, and 250 from New Orleans. Uh, the storm is likely to develop somewhere to the south of that coastline and then swing in towards the north uh, we're expecting the landfall zone will be somewhere in western or central Louisiana later on this week, but still there is a lot of uncertainty. Looking at the total rainfall over the next five days, you can see this rather glitched imagery, but you can still see how it paints the uh, tail nonetheless. Um, huge amounts of rainfall expected over parts of Louisiana and into neighboring states as well. We could be talking maybe up to 16 inches in some coastal areas um, and 8 inches quite in quite a lot of other areas too. Sea surface temperatures will probably aid that because they are so warm right now. 30 or 31 degrees Celsius uh, off the coast here and they've really warmed up in the last week or so. So looking now at the wind graphic, if you see any green colours on the screen, those are tropical storm force winds. So the GFS model has this system developing into a tropical storm. You can start to see those greens there. And then as we enter the weekend, it starts to turn towards the north and then makes landfall there as a tropical storm and then moving inland uh, and weakening, of course. So that's the GFS there calling for a landfall somewhere. Uh, in central Louisiana, a lot of other models now on board with that too. The chances of tropical storm force winds are now as follows. 10% in Gulfport, 30% in New Orleans, 60% in Morgan City, 30% in Lake Charles and 20% in Port Arthur. Now those are just general ideas that they will get revised as time goes on. So the uh, local National Weather Service offices going out with all their information today. The Tallahassee office talking about the 90% chance from this system, as is Mobile. New Orleans showing you the potential rainfall up to 15 inches they're calling for in Humor and Lafayette. And in Lake Charles also calling for the same stuff there with that heavy rain. There's the Houston office showing those high temperatures today, 97 in the Houston area and in Corpus Christi into the hundreds inland thunderstorms to the northeast. So uh, you can see the latest satellite imagery. This is uh, Go 16 one minute imagery that we're showing you just so that you can see what exactly has been happening pretty much up to the minute. You can see some convective bursts that are blowing up there, but still it's struggling to organize itself. We still haven't really seen um, a bona fide center of circulation yet. We're still looking out for it. It looks as though it might be developing to the southeast of all of that convective activity right now there is some major thunderstorms occurring in Louisiana in the New Orleans area as well that's all for now we'll have more updates you can follow Force 13's outlets the website force13.com you can also find our YouTube channel if you're not there already you may well be good chance of that subscribe if you haven't you can also find our Facebook page search Force 13 all in text and our Twitter handle it's at Force 13 on there you can also help the project become even better by becoming a patron. You can see more information about all the benefits involved by visiting patreon.com forward slash force 13. You can also contact me on Discord. It's fool13 at extension 9094 and force13 on Skype. You can also find our server link to our Discord server for tropical weather chat in our description.